Good morning everyone. It's a very wet and rainy October morning. Um, and we are off out again with Darcy. We're gonna take her to Golden Cross for another little jump. So Darcy, you've probably seen her in a few of our videos. She, yeah, she, she came to us as a four year old. Yep. And so she's new for education. Um, she's been with us about a year now. Yeah. And she's actually five now. Um, but we thought we'd show you a little bit about how we get them started jumping. Yeah. And uh, with Darcy, um, it's all been very, taking it very slowly with her. So when she came, we just practiced out hacking really, following an older horse, doing some natural obstacles, didn't we? Yeah, taking over some logs in the woods and yeah. things like that. And then at home doing pole work and sort of obstacles that are kind of like a bit spook busting as well. So tile poolings and all stuff like that to kind of desensitise her so when her owner eventually takes her home she's known to be sort of quite well educated and easy for her to do yeah um, but now she needs to start kind of getting on with it a little bit more because she's coming towards six now yeah so we're going to do a little bit more with the show jumping aren't we yeah we've taken her cross country quite a bit as well haven't yeah. we yeah uh, it's so good for the young horses just follow an older horse and kind of do all the natural obstacles yeah um, the ditches and so she does yeah. ditches water yeah she does like that. so it's really good for her yeah so yeah now we're just going to try and work on the um show jumping a little bit aren't we yeah so show jumping this morning she's been out a couple of times hasn't she to yeah do, um some little sort yeah. of practice stuff yeah and quite and a little bit of dressage as well yeah, yeah. Okay. so yeah we're just going to try and um get her a bit more educated with that yeah Another thing that we try and do is give the young horses a really nice experience traveling when they first start going out in the horse box. So really local shows and, or local venues, yeah. sorry. Yeah. And nice experiences, driving really nice and slowly. And that will help get them to travel really nicely. And as you can see, Darcy is so chilled in the back there now. I don't even know if she's in there. No, you can't hear anything from her. She's just munching on her hay net, happily um, out of the it's rain. She's been so relaxed so yeah. far, hasn't it? Yeah. She's trying to keep it relaxed. Exactly. So we're at Golden Cross. Vicky's warming up now. And you can see all the jumps. And at the moment, we're not really ready to jump this sort of height. So what I will do is put some of them down and just put them on the floor so that Vicky can just literally trot through them and find a nice rhythm and then canter through them. And then we'll start popping them up and just letting her do a little, little course. So what we're going to start with is just trotting, trotting a pole and actually you can see all the jumps now that I've just put right down so that we can just have a nice trot over, find a nice rhythm, make it really simple. Because <laughs> we just want her to get, be confident about it, we don't want to frighten her. to Vicky. Just do it in the trot. If she picks up the canter that's fine. But then just start to put one or two together. Better. So then you want to start to put a few more together and then just, just try and keep the rhythm between the fences. So, way. And those, don't turn her around, just make a walk over from there. 
that's it because she can walk over that and then just come around and do it again that's fine as long as you don't turn away just stay there and just you know make a walk over And again, do that same one. And then add in number three. But she might well look, so just be prepared. Good, well done. So what this really teaches the horses is about going forwards. They learn to go forwards. So good. Darcy's done all of these little jumps individually now. So now we're going to put the horse together. She's just done the little course and she did really well. We probably haven't been in here much more than say half an hour but you know she gets tired and the thing is, is we don't want her to then start making mistakes so you know 20 minutes half an hour that's more than enough and then what we'll start doing is this a little bit more regular so we'll probably like aim to bring her once a week because um, we don't have a set of jumps at home so this is quite nice so maybe we'll sort of venture out to different places as well to hire just so that she keeps seeing all different things but she's done really well today she's really um vicky's done a great job with her because she's been jumping her from the beginning so yeah really really pleased yeah.